Lads, lasses, welcome to Margate to Glory. It is the biggest episode on record. Hands down, FA Cup final, Margate up against Arsenal. The current champions, this is going to be slightly better than 2007, 2008 when Portsmouth met Cardiff ugh, in the FA Cup final. This is going to be a huge game. The boys are raring to go. I'm suited. I'm not wearing boots. In fact, I'm wearing a pair of shorts, but... You know, less you know the better. The champagne is on ice and I'm raring to go. Let's get into it. That is right, everybody. We're back. And we're back for the FA Cup final. The Emirates FA Cup final up against Arsenal. It's going to be huge. They are the current Premier League champions. A fantastic team on paper. But we've had a brilliant season as well. Nobody has scored more goals. Nobody's played better football than Margate. In the whole of the country. In the whole of the world. So we're going to give it a good crack. If you have enjoyed this fantastic series so far, hit that thumbs up button. If you're new to it, if you're jumping in just for this, this glory, welcome in. Stay on board and maybe subscribe to the channel if you like it. I am suited up. It is boiling. I'm not going to lie. So the weather is going to make me sweat, not just the football on the pitch, I'm certain. But before we get into the game, I want to show you some awards that have crept through. And one person in particular has mopped up. And that person is Caio Gabriel. What a man, what a man, what a mighty good man. He's not only won English Footballer of the Year, he's not only won English Players Player of the Year, but he has won the English Players Young Player of the Playing Young Players of the Playing Year Award. Rolls off the tongue. What a man. He's 20 years old. If we look at his polygon, it's not that good, is it? There are gaps in his game, and I say that a lot. He... Uh, I hope he doesn't listen to me. I know he's a fictional character, but I still hope he doesn't listen to me because every time I look at him, I say he's not that good, even though he's he's achieving very well. It's it's clearly my ego. I don't like the fact that this lad is better than me, but he's had a, a brilliant season. 35 games, 39 games across the whole of the competitions, 11 goals, 22 assists. What a man. I'm, I'm not going to say that bit again, but brilliant. In terms of the goal of the season... El Mustao came second. We're not going to look at his goal, but it was probably brilliant. And look at this. Look at this. It's us against Arsenal in the FA Cup final. So it's quite poignant that in terms of the media, or not even the media, the English Premier Division Team of the Year, we've got four, and they've got one, two, three, four, six. And they are a good team. They are better defensively. We're better going forward. We're gonna we're gonna win. I, I think anyway, it's gonna be tough. And like I say, the boys are raring to go. The team cohesion, the club atmosphere, the managerial support, everybody is happy. Everybody is skipping into training. You know, I say everybody. Most people are. To be fair, I've put these in the under 23. So everybody in the first team is loving life. If we look at the hierarchy and we look at myself at the top of the tree, ah. Oh, I love that. Everybody loves Johnny. Even those boys who, who want to leave. They, they know it's not to do with me. It's just there's better players on that pitch. So do not upset the apple cart. And this is a nice screen to look at. I rarely come on to it, but the cool social group, apart from Yaskaline and Kelly and Stewart, who were out the door anyway this summer, we are just the Christmas party. They're all on the same table. COVID restrictions have gone. These boys are on top of each other. They love each other. And I'm hoping they're going to love each other on that pitch because this this is the 11 that I've put the white suits on, Liverpool style, send that onto the pitch, and I'm hoping they're going to do well. If you look, there's something else on the screen that scares me. It's the amount of wanted signs. So many players in our team are wanted by some big boys as well. Caio Gabriel, Barcelona are sniffing. Musri got Manchester United in for him and Janicic. So it's going to be a busy summer trying to fight away the big teams. I don't know what the fuck that is, but if we can fight them off, we might do even better next season. Who knows? So the 11 we're going with, let's have a look at them. We never do this. Let's look at Burak Bas. There he is, goalkeeper, Dutch international. I love Burak. He is Mr. Stable. 
He's not a horse. He's just very stable on the pitch. Great man. Janicic, probably one of the weak links in the team, but he's done very well. He's a right-footed, left-sided defender, very suited for that inverted wing-back. And like I say, if we look at his wanted badge, Manchester United, you dirty devils. On the right-hand side, I've actually gone in and I've made an inquiry for this guy. If you look at his season, he's been so good. He's in the dream, not the dream 11, the best 11 in the Premier League. And he's brilliant. What a good right back. He's had such a good season. I, I want him. I want him in my team. And I want to own him. Klemencic, who we only brought in in January, has had a solid time of it. Not above a seven, but my centre-backs rarely do. With the way we play, so attacking, I kind of hang them out to dry. But Jose Klemencic, what a lad. Very good signing. And Marcelo... Again, when you compare him to Klemencic, his defending is, is pretty trash, to be fair. Look at the difference. So that's another area I'll be looking to improve. Sorry, Marcel. So I know we're like two minutes before the game and I'm telling you that I'm going to sell you, but this is the way it's going to be. Mustri, he's probably one of my favourite players in the whole save so far. He's coming in. He's going to stay here for life. He's not going anywhere. He's our club captain, I think. Yeah, he is. Of course he is. Tenacious defensive midfielder. Good season. Mr. Dependable. I love a bit of Musri. And then Klesura and Kayo Gabriel. We looked at Kayo already, but Klesura. Again, I love this guy. Very good stat. He's only worth 14 and a half million. Not a lot of our players are worth the 30, 40, 50 million pounds. That'll come, no doubt, when we when we win this competition. Right, the cam roll, the Trek Watista. Of course, Martin Martinez get on the bench for a start. He is injured. So Nita's coming in. The lad we signed, was it January? No, it wasn't. It was the start of the season. And he's done very well. When he's played, he scored goals and he's got assists. And I'm very happy he's on the pitch. And I'm very happy we bought him. Because if it wasn't for him, we would have a very poor person playing in this position. And he's He's very good, isn't he? And then finally, the two boys up top, where all the majority of the goals have come from. Let's start off with El Musao, who's fantastic. 22 goals in the league, the top goal scorer. Brilliant player. I want at least a goal off him today. And alongside him is probably my signing of the season. Considering we only paid £14 million, and he's actually worth £31 million. Fantastic. Argentinian international. Great mentals. Nobody wants him. Thank God. Stay under the radar. He's a good player, isn't he? And that is the 11 we're going with. And do you know what? The bench as well. I was looking at Oliver's profile the other day. And he is at a very good FA Cup run. And there's an argument there that I'm not even going to get into that he should start. He's played one game at, from the start and three off the bench and scored four goals and one assist with a 7.53 average he deserves to lift the cup but he's he's on the bench because he's, he's not better than the two up top so that's the team that's the bench my job is done there's nothing more i can do but send them onto the pitch click on demand more every 10 minutes and then hope they they do well of course okay team talk time and the assistant, he can bugger off. I'm not going to tell them that nobody expects them to win because I expect them to win. The fans do. These fans have been fantastic for us. They're the ones who really pay your wages. Go out there and win the trophy. And I'm going to outstretch. No, I'm going to pump my fit, pump my fists. We got one motivated, lots of compote. We got a few. We, it's good. It's good. Right. Okay. Wembley. It looks rather red. Why is it red? That's like the Arsenal colours. It shouldn't be red. Anyway, let's kick off. Let's go. Okay, the minute's ticking by. We're on extended highlights. I want to see a bit more from this game. And hang on, we've got a highlight. This is... Why is it so fast? It feels fast. It's not fast, is it? I'm just... I'm panicking. It's my heart rate. Ramsdale. But I can't... I am going to slow it down. It feels too fast for me. I'm, I'm panicking. Zaniolo's very good from there. We clear it. Nita's got the pace to break and do nothing with it. Oh, God. 11 minutes gone. Arsenal throw in. Vallejo out wide into Zaniola. Mustri, what are you doing? Oh, that's not good. Martinelli's there. Clear it. Close him down. Well done, Conan. Don't, don't foul. Don't foul. Zaniola is causing me a lot of stress so far. Martinelli's there. This Arsenal team are clearly very good. Vallejo in acres of space. Where's he going? Oh, Smith cleared. No. Janicic, get in there. This has been a very scruffy start. Okay, another throw in. Vallejo on the ball. We close him down. Eat it as well. Go forward, mate. Go forward. The runners are there. The pass is on. Pass. You didn't pass it. You did. Petolana. Put the ball in. That's terrible. Oh, my word. That is scruffy. Okay, and encourage the boys. We have another highlight. Another throw in. Bragancha into Martinelli. 
comes inside. He's covered well, though. Can we nab that ball and break? We go, those two boys up top. We're going to cause trouble all the way through. Dest into Martinelli. Oh, Burak Bass, you sexy bastard. Well done. Okay, coming up to the half hour mark. It's been all Arsenal. 60% possession, more shots. But here we go. Highlight for us. Throw in. It's simple. Konish, give it to the man in front of you. Well done. Kyle Gabriel, back to him. Back to Moussi. Back to him again. Do something. Well done, Kyle Gabriel. Cut inside. Nita's there. Klesura's there. Klesura! Come on! <laughs> no! What a rocket of a shot. Come on! The 30-minute mark has just gone, and we're 1-0 up. Mustri on the ball. This is very scruffy, but Caio Gabriel picks it up. Bit of composure. Tanita comes back to Klesura, surrounded by men, and puts it in the top corner. Come on! A very nervy highlight so far. Martinelli comes forward with the ball, goes back to Bergancha. Martinelli again. These boys have had a lot more possession than we have, but we are 1-0 up. Let's not forget that. And they're coming forward well. Martinelli out wide. Close him down. Dump. Oh, you got to be kidding me. Football manager, that wasn't a penalty. Got to be fixed. He doesn't deserve to score. Sinclair. You... Honestly, what? The penalties in this game, they're so soft. They're as bad as the English national football team. Let's skip that. One all. 35 minutes and we've lost our little advantage because they are much the better team we're going to go very short to pass and slow it down let's be a bit more disciplined and narrow things up for the last five minutes and i'm going to tell the boys praise them a bit Vallejo on the ball they're coming forward again oh and that was a wild shot wide one all and that's going to be the halftime whistle certainly it is okay right halftime team talk again i'm not listening to this as the manager he's, he's just He's too positive today. I want to get into these faces. We we should be doing well. So get out there and prove to everyone that you're winners. Motivated, apart from Marcelo, who's nervous, but fine. Insta highlight to Arsenal. Can we close him down and get another goal? I've taken the half time to... to oh, no. Is he off? Oh, I saw the yellow then and I panicked. Chris, who are you, madman? It's okay, though. Right, let's... Demand a bit more. It's the 50th minute. Zaniola, who's been brilliant today so far. Vallejo, Bragancha. It's been all Arsenal. They deserve the win, but come on, it's the FA Cup. Anything can happen. Oh, I don't like this. Aremibi, Sinclair, Zaniolo. Oh, God, alive. This is not pretty football, is it? Vallejo, back to Bragancha. They're coming forward again. This is relentless. This, this is like a salmon running upstream. And it's a goal kick. To the waterfall in that stream. Okay, 50th minute. Kai Gabriel, he's got an opportunity. Good ball. Marcelo. Oh, keeper tips it over. Does he? No, it's hit the crossbar. I need to make some changes. Mustri is absolutely knackered. But let's get this highlight out of the way first of all. Bragancho and the ball. We don't want it well. Musa win that. You've got to win that. It's come down to us though. Kayo, you got the pace. Run. You've got numbers. we got numbers. Do something. Oh, it's, it's come back to him. Is it a handball? Oh, no. Kayo, that's it. Recycle it. Back in there. Terrible ball. No, it's not. Conan's there. Into Nita. Turn it on your left peg. Janicic on your right peg. Conan. Great ball. Musau. Oh. Ramsdale. Reactions of a hawk. Not a ram. Okay, made some changes. All of us come on. For Musri, who's knackered. I put Nita back. Petalan has dropped into the cam roll. And all of us up top. Klesura, you were snapping everyone today. Don't be sent off. Don't be... Oh, no. Just made a bloody sub as well. Klesura has been angry today, isn't he? Even though it says calm under my head, he has been an angry, angry man. Oh, who do I put out there now? Oh, right. Two seconds. Okay, I've done this. I don't want to use up all my substitutes in case this goes any further in the competition. Petzalan is staying behind the striker, but we're going to lose one. Oliver's going to go out on the right hand side, which he's happy playing. He's not very good there. And Caio Gabriel's going on the left, which he hates. But Kayo, mate, I need you to do something for me. Petalan has wound up as well. He's in danger of being booked. Oh, the boys' heads are going. And I need to be calm. So what I'm going to do is shout. Calm down. There we go. Nita, don't snap him. Martinelli on the ball. Oh, it's 10 against 11. We're positive. I've changed a few things up with the instructions. Vallejo, don't let... Well done, Marcelo. Get it out. Get it out. 
oh no, he's offside, he's not. Oh, we're losing in the 66 minutes, those 10 men. I feel silly now, I'm wearing a suit. Do I just leave them? Do I walk off the pitch? So I see those here, Vallejo's there. Good tackle, ball comes in, just so easy. A penalty, a red card, neither of which should have stood. The red card maybe should have, let's be honest, but right, we need to go attack in. We, we can't just sit back and we let me sort some stuff out. Right, final changes have been made. We've gone tactically very narrow. We're going to underlap. Oh no, it's a corner to Arsenal, 75th minute. Brocancha comes in, Marcelo clears it well. We need to break now, we're on attack. And Nita's there, and he's got the pace. Look at the numbers busting forward. Come on, please. This would be the perfect time to equalise. That's a dreadful pass, you crap player. Win it back, damn it. Oh, Vallejo, good tackle, Nita, you brilliant player. I love you. Martinez were brought on, injured, by the way. His agent would not be happy, but Kaya Gabriel cupped inside, back into Nita. This is neat. This is good. Martinez has come on a bit of class. It's not a classy pass, though, mate. Oh, Sassi doesn't win that one. He's in a skin, his man. This isn't good. This is back and forth football. Good tackle, Marcelo. No! Hang on. No way. No way. No way. Don't you dare send him off. You, you stupid ref. You stupid ref. You've ruined everything. Oh, you absolute arsehole. Oh, absolute turbo prick. Oh, my has gone now. I've used all my subs as well on strikers. I brought an injured Trek Watista on, and now I've got one centre back. Well, you're going to have to go there. You're going to have to go. No, you're going to have to go there, but you're going to have to go maybe defend. He can't play centre back. Janicic can, though, can he? Let's do that. And let's bring Benavides back here. Leave Martinez up there. Nita can go there. Let's just put him up there, and you can sit there. Stay on attack. Just hoof the ball up. Better swap him around, though. Oh my God! What a what a game! Don't score. Oh, it's off the beans on toast. Oh, twice. But a gancha. Don't make it three one. We're still in this game, though. By the way, we're not, do we? We've got nine men. Play for set pieces. Let's keep the ball. Keep it nice and slow. Be more disciplined. Just keep the ball narrow. Don't pass into space. Keep the ball. Work it in. No, don't work into the box. That will do. Okay. Ten minutes to go. Let's demand more from my nine players. Oh, it's another highlight. Can we break? Why is that the first thing I think of when it's a corner to those? Bragancha. Janicic clears. Go on, run. You're never going to get there, but still run. Smith crab walk. Well done, Oliver. Well done, mate. Careful, though. Ref might send you off for touching the ball. Sinclair. Bragancha. Where's he going? He's gone out wide to Dest. Where's he going? Out wide. Tackle him. Don't you dare give a penalty, ref. Oh, Burakbas. Burakbas. Come on. We've got eight minutes left. We need to go super attacking, bird, don't we? My right, Brakancha. Yet another corner. Ball comes in. Can we clear it? We can. Clementic is there. Nobody's there to mop it up. Even though my shape, there are lots of people stood on the outside of that box. Maybe they're the ones being sent off, though. Benavides clears it. Oliver's there to mop it up. Nita, what are you doing? We're on super short passing. This could be our last chance. We're going very attacking. We're going wide because that's where we need to be. Overlap. Uh, we've got nobody in the middle, so focus down wide. Hit early crosses. <clears throat> Direct passing. Super high tempo. Dribble less. More expressive. In transition. Yes, distribute quickly, please. Out of possession, super high. Let them get in behind. This is it, boys and girls. Five minutes. Look at this attack. Look at the massive gap in the middle. We haven't got a Scooby-Doo chance in hell. Okay. Fingers crossed. Let's get a go. Burapas, Clementic. Gives it away immediately, even though we're on short passing. You, oh, Vallejo on the ball. Where's he going? Bragancha in acres of space. Look at them. There's like 12 more players they've got. Good tackle. But again, nobody in that central midfielder spot. Martinez wins it. Outside. Out the other way. No, you slow old man. Get him off. Did he send him off? He didn't even book him. Referee, man, you absolute. Oh, and it was a chance as well. Sinclair. Ari, maybe panic at the disco. Oh, look at this. Look at this. Bula Bass has kept us in this game, hasn't he? Oh, what a mess of a tactic. I'm just throwing boys up there now. 
It's dem- oh, I can't demand anymore. Right, five minutes added on. It's a last highlight, 92 minutes. Can we go into extra time? Even though my boys are dead on their feet. Panic, go out wide. Snap in. Come on, let's get another one sent off. Conan. I'm only joking, mate, don't. Martinez on the ball. Head up. Good ball. Oliver Strew. Oliver Strew. Go on. <gasps> Oliver. Don't say he's offside. What's what's the line now doing? He better... If this... If he takes that goal off me now, please tell me we can with nine men. It's a goal. Come on. Look at Oliver. He's gone. He's got pace of three. And I didn't think you'd have scored from there. Right, hang on. Pause. We need to get everything sorted tactically now. Oh, my word. Right, give me two, two minutes. Okay. Okay. Changes mid, but it's a bloody free kick. 93rd. No. No! No! Oh, no, no, no. No way. Oh, look at his space. He's off. Is he offside? Oh, no. Uh, football manager. You. Oh, oh, that's a tough one. That 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 that's gonna burn for a while. That one is. Come on, go on, boys. Lift lift your trophy, you stupid gunners. That, that oh, I'm hurt. I'm really hurt right now. Nine men. A penalty that wasn't. <laughs> really hurt. I'm I'm genuinely gutted now. That is going to put fuel onto the fire, though. I'm certain of it. We're going to remember this with an avenge, a, a vengeance. 3-2 against Arsenal. Look at that. Oh, my word. Stunned. Can't really believe we lost. Kelvin, you're not wrong, mate. You win some, you lose some. We'll do the same to somebody else before too long. Dale, I like your optimism. Jean Mal, feel sorry for the players we had left on the pitch. Their teammates let them down today. Sorry, Jean, like it wasn't. It was the referee. He was filth. Pure filth. Well, that's it, boys and girls. That's, that is the end of this season. Which, that's, that's amazing. You know, the Carabao Cup, forget about that. That's, that's not a real cup, is it? But a final run against Arsenal. Coming second to Arsenal in the league. I, I now hate Arsenal, to be fair. We're going to destroy Arsenal next season. That is the plan, without a shadow of a doubt. So there we have it, everybody. That is the end of this season. I'll be back very shortly with an exciting new season in the Champions League. We'll look at the draw we're in. We're going to go straight to the group stages. I'm going to spend some serious money this summer buying all of Arsenal's players and then put them in the reserves. But before I do any of that, I'm going to go and take this stupid suit off and, and lick my wounds a bit, I think, because that still hurts, doesn't it? But hopefully, you boys and girls enjoyed that. If you did, as always, hit that thumbs up button. As always, if you're not, subscribe or at least consider. And I'll see you here next time for the next episode of Margate to Glory. Take care.